dude, that Mindy chick is off the hook. I wish she was mine. Green pipes every day, all day. Woo know what I'm saying, sweetie? I'm ready to go big. I was born to go big. I want to go bigger. Hello, hello, we got some breaking news here on Tony Hawk's Demolition Radio, a Sirius Satellite Radio exclusive. It is official. Thanks to all the crew over at American Wasteland, Iggy Van Zant is now the official owner of the renowned Green Pipes Point Skate Park. There's a massive blowout party happening tonight, so grab your deck, cruise on over, and enjoy the ride. Yo, 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 tell Iggy and all your homies I said, what's up, baby? Okay, hello everybody, uh, Andy Man's Car here with you once again. Sorry about that really late intro. Uh, I paused it on purpose for that reason, so I wouldn't have to bother with it. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, that was pretty much what you get afterwards. I mean, the credits kind of happen afterwards as well, but I don't want I don't want to show that off just yet. Um, not until the very end of the project anyway, so... Uh, let's go ahead and ride around a little bit and fall immediately. Okay, that's cool. It's all good. And you can see, you can see, you have all these uh, skaters and shit riding around us and all that stuff. Um, actually, we do need to go to one place that we didn't get a chance to um, throughout the game. Or I kind of forgot about it, and then at the end of the game was already kind of already showed up. So, all right, well, end of story mode, I should say, to be more specific. And I'm trying to get up to here. Won't let me though. Okay, finally. All right. <clears throat> And, if it's not obvious, I don't think it ever will. I don't think it ever will. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think it could ever be more obvious, honestly. Um, yeah, so we're gonna go back to the, um, to the Am Jam, where we did have a few missions, or a few, um, pro skater vids. I mean, I know it's kind of pointless, but you have, I think, it I'm pretty sure it's required in order to get all the missions complete. Um, let me go ahead and double check on it. Let's see. 93 out of 95. Yeah, it is. I think it is. I don't know. And... <clears throat> and these two missions, I mean, one of them's not too bad, and one of them kind of really sucks, actually. It takes several attempts on. Um, in fact, we're going to take care of the hardest one first, actually. And here we go. Justin Bieber? Oh, Ryan Sheckler. Okay. Okay, it skipped the dialogue again for some reason. What he's what he wanted to do is he wants to get this Jeep, and uh, for no per no real reason, because I guess he likes it. And uh, yeah, we talked to him about getting it and all that stuff, and he's like, "Yeah, man, it'd be pretty sweet and all this stuff." So yeah, nothing too fancy, but, like I said, this mission could be kind of annoying, but we might, uh, no, we didn't, I was going to say, we might be able to get it right here, but then, I, of course, that's when I had open my big mouth, naturally, whoa, that's not how it works, okay, but don't worry, um, I am going to cut, I am going to cut, um, because this is definitely way more attempts than it should require. I don't want to waste so much time. <laughs> Could have done it again, but all that would have happened was it would have fucking just said, nope, wrong. Yeah, you're not fucking with me this time, motherfucker. Finally! God.
Alright, so after 15 minutes of that crap, I think it, no, it wasn't 15, it was a little less than 13, but still, it took a really long time. Okay, um, this next mission actually requires the bike, so let's go ahead and get that right quick. Wherever it's at, okay, here we go. Oh, come on, thorn fuck. Okay, I don't have to... I get to ignore him. Okay, good. Alright, uh, yep, we're gonna just run over here right quickly. And hopefully this won't... This shouldn't take long. This is actually the easier... Like I said, I wanted to get the hard mission out of the way first. And... I'm about to just sit there and get back on my skateboard or do something. Okay. Yeah, I'm apparently still terrible at riding the bike, so... Okay, let's go ahead and talk to him. Finally! Oh, shit, come on. You fucking ro rotten cocksucker. Okay. Apparently we need the skateboard, but that's bullshit. It's completely bullshit, I think. He's gonna make us do the other way around. Watch this. See? Told you! What was the fucking point in that? Okay, um, I actually totally forgot how to do a backflip already. I think it was that. Yeah, okay. And see, I don't know why it's skipping all the damn dialogue. That's... It's fucking pissing me off. I am sorry. It is absolutely pissing me off right now. Because it should not be doing that at all. What so goddamn ever. Either that or I glitched it to the point where it won't ever work again. You gotta do the backflip first. You cannot do the 180 and then do the backflip. Thank you. You see how much better that works? And then... Yeah, there we go. Uh, or... Okay, there we go. Did it right! Yeah, don't get fancy with it. It's okay. Abs and then he ends up back on the polar opposite zi side. For no reason. No reason. No fucking logical explanation whatsoever. That was just a single tail whip. I don't know how I couldn't possibly have landed that. At least it still counts. Um, that's all I'm worried about. Okay. And then the X up. Of course, the stupid asshole now just magically becomes six times faster. No, nope, do it again. There we go. See, he just picks... It just seems like he picks the fucking speed in which he's going. He doesn't actually fucking do it for you. Come on, you motherfucker. Finally! Thank you. Alright, there we go. All story mode goals complete. And... Murphy hooked us up with this sweet limo. Do a combo challenge on the Bail Bonds limo. All right, so on this one, it's base. It's a pretty, ver it's a very, very simple trick. Just get a little grind in there and just do a flip trick. There you go. Boom. Done. Out of the way. Already. Boom. Goes the dynamite. <laughs> Sounds like something Donald Trump would say. <clears throat> Boom. Goes the dynamite. Out of here. Fantastic. Beautiful. Has been crashing on this couch since you saved him. Do a combo over it. And once again, another very simple trick. Just don't jump over like I just did right there. Just do a very basic grind trick, and there you go. Flip trick, win. Fantastic, beautiful, you're fired. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, he doesn't really say that, but you know, still. If he's mad enough, he would. Get a big combo on this thing. All right, twenty-four thousand points. This this gets a little bit more difficult, but it's definitely it's still not that challenging because it's a it's a nice and long rail, and you can get about twenty thousand just with 
just before you get off the rail. And then Flip Trick would just save the day. There you go. Done, son. Yeah. And alright, next to, now on to the next one. He will be stoked that you got him a tool shed. I'm sure he would be. I would I'd be stoked for a tool shed. Get a big if I ever did tools with it. Or if I ever actually did stuff with tools. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, basically you wanna get a you wanna get a stall on there. That's pretty that's the easiest way to go about it. Uh, the easiest and most broken way possible. Uh, yeah, do some, you know, variants, variations. Boom. Done. Alright, we're gonna fly up here. Fly into the sign, which would have actually been a pretty neat little trick to do, but not really. This sign was getting in the way in East L.A. See if it skates any better here. Skate it and land a big combo. All right, and you nothing really too fancy here. You can just you just pretty much have to do that, do what I'm doing right now. I think this is probably the easiest way to do it, in my opinion. But you know, just my opinion, really. Even though I think I already said that, but you know, I just love re being redundant. Being redundant is my favorite. Alright, and we're gonna go over here and we're gonna do something. I don't know what we're doing. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's exactly where she wasn't at, actually. She was like not even close to there. And this actually takes a few tries, because it is a hundred ten thousand. It's it's pretty much it's one of the it's actually I think this mission by itself is actually harder than probably the hardest mission in the in the story mode game. Um, oh no, I would say this is actually something like closer to the Ryan Sheckler mission. This is, that's what I think. It's pretty difficult, but it's not the most difficult. But it's close. But you were close! Okay, anyway. And then we're gonna do some nice fancy tricks, even though all I'm really doing is jumping and riding around and wall running and cavemaning and no complying and all those fancy tricks not really they're not, none of those are fancy whatsoever all right and now we're going to go to probably the probably the hardest mission beyond all others those rails will launch you out over the ranch grind a boost and trust me this one is by far the hardest one i think this is way harder than i wouldn't say this is way harder than that tony trujillo mission cuz this one i could actually complete it was just a fucking pain in the ass. Like, this attempt right here actually took me roughly... It took me about 15 minutes, actually. So it was actually longer than the Ryan Sheckler mission. It took... And it, it's, and it's a lot of button mashing, too. That's the thing about it. And a lot of button mashing. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> I mean, some... I mean, like, the really good... The, like, the people that are really, really good at this game have no problem doing it, I'm sure. But I'm not one of those people. I'll tell you that. Uh, but yeah, since we're at about 14 minutes at this point, um, I'm going to go ahead and cut it off right here. And in the next episode, should probably be the final episode. So, um, yeah, we're just going to finish things up from here. And so I thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye!